Hi friends, welcome to Tech Trends. In this video, you can see how to do home automation using Google Assistant V2 and Blink IoT. Let's get started. Activate, turn on the light. Okay, activating the turn on the light. Activate, turn off the light. Got it, activating the turn off the light. Activate, turn on the light. Alright, activating the turn on the light. Activate, turn off the light. Okay, activating the turn off the light. The components required for this experiment are Node MCU board, relay, connecting wires, connecting cable and a bulb. Now first we can connect the bulb with the relay. Connect one end of the two pin to the first pin in the relay. Connect other end of the bulb to the second pin in the relay. Now we can connect the relay with the node MCU board. The relay has three pin. Connect the ground pin to the ground pin in the node MCU and connect the plus pin to the pin VU in the node MCU and connect the signal pin to pin number D2. Now log into the bling.cloud website and go to the templates page. Here click on new template and give any name for the template. Now select the hardware as ESP8266 and connection type as Wi-Fi. And click on done. Now go to data streams and click new data stream and select digital. Here give any name for the variable and select the pin as 4 and now click on create. Now go to web dashboard and drag a switch widget and here click on the settings button and select the data stream. Now click save. Now again click save from here. Now go to this search button and click new device and here select from template and here we can see the template which we created now. Now click create. Now copy this template id, device name and authentication token to our program. Now paste those here. Now select the board from tools, board, ESP8266 and select node MC 1.0 and then select the port. Now click this arrow button and upload the program to the node MCU board. Now the program is uploaded. Now go to ifttt.com website and log in to the website. Now click on create. Here we need to create two applet, one to turn on the light and another one applet to turn off the light. Now click this add button in if this. Here we need to select Google Assistant and here we can see Google Assistant V2. Click on this. Now click activate scene. Here we need to give the text which we use, which we are using to turn on the light. Now I am giving the text as turn on the light and click create trigger. Now click the add button near to then that. Here we need to search for web hooks and click make a web request. Now here we need to enter the URL. To get this URL we need to go to this docs.bling.io website. And here we need to select the URL based on our location. Now I am selecting to the URL corresponding to Bangalore location. 
So this is our complete URL. And the first part of the URL is depends on the location. And here we need to enter the token. This token we will get from the Blink.Cloud website. So this is our authentication token. Copy this and paste here. Now we need to select the pin. The digital pin which we selected in Blink is 4. So we need to select the pin as D4. And to turn on the light, we need to give the value as 1. And similarly, to turn off the light, the URL will, will change to D4 equal to 0. Now first we can copy this first URL and paste here. Now click create action. Now click on continue and click finish. Now we need to create one more applet to turn off the light. Again click on create. Click this add button. Search for Google Assistant V2 and click on activate scene and here enter the text as turn off the light. Now click create trigger. Now click add button next to then that and search for web hooks. Click make a web request and copy the second URL to turn off the light. Now click on create action and click on continue and click finish. Now we have created the applet. Now we need to set up the mobile application. For that download the Google Home application from the Play Store. Now open this Google Home application and click this plus button in the top left and click create new home and give any name. Now click on continue. And click skip. And then click continue without address. Now again click the plus button on the left side and click set up new device. And now click works with Google. Now here we need to search for IFTTT. Now click on IFTTT. And click on the authorize button. Now the IFTT is linked with Google Home. Now go back again. Now we can check the output. Activate turn on the light. Okay, activating the turn on the light. Activate turn off the light. Got it. Activating the turn off the light. Activate turn on the light. Alright, activating the turn on the light. Activate turn off the light. Okay, activating the turn off the light.